Hey, everybody. Yep, not on camera this time. Can't help it. Ugh, my hands. Now, I'm kind of sick of seeing it, so I thought I would do a little bit of a video. And as you can see here, you probably already know what this is about. That is contrast. That is a wash. And guys, if you're careful with these things, they're not going to spill over. You've got blue tack. But when I saw these, I wanted to give it a shot because they're awesome looking and it's a kiwi. Yeah. So if you haven't guessed and you haven't been following me on Instagram, um, you would have seen I've gone a bit nuts with these because I actually really like them. They're silly enough. Um, they're these things. So this is a paint pot holder. This is for GW stuff. Probably will hold other things too, but yep. It's just laser cut um, MDF. You guys know how much I love this stuff. I mean, look at the thing I'm, I usually work on. Um, I love this stuff. I love the smell. It's just amazing. And this thing goes together in about four seconds. Now, Battle Kiwi doesn't know I'm doing this video. Uh, I bought these myself, but I love them. I wanna share them. I'm gonna have a link to these in the description. Um, cause if you've seen anything on Facebook, you've seen someone spill one of these, take a photo, post it. I think I've been guilty of that once very, very long time ago. And since then I've been very, very careful with these. Um, but accidents do happen. So, um, yeah, I mean, these things go together super quick. Um, there's not many parts. I recommend some super glue just to hold everything together. I haven't super glued this together yet. I put it together just to see how easy it was and it fits really, really cool. Now that little kiwi on the top, he actually, he's not just useless, like a kiwi. The animal, not the actual people. Oh, I'm gonna get in so much trouble for that one. All right, um, but yeah, so, Pop everything out. There's that little kiwi. He's cool. Look. I love that. His little kiwi with a gun. I mean, that is a logo. So, Battle Kiwi. BattleKiwi.com. Um, postage is pretty, absolutely 100% reasonable. I wouldn't even complain. In fact, it turned up quicker than most things through my own Australia post. Because those lot are kind of useless getting things from anywhere. So guys, typical with laser cut, you just gotta take something to poke all them. Don't throw those bits out, keep them. You never know, you might need it. And then you've got these little two on the side. These are cool. Very aquillery. I like them. I'm sure I'm gonna get corrected on what they are exactly. And it goes together like, so you take bit, bit, Slots in. I was going to tie myself doing this, but I decided absolutely not to. And that just fits in like so once you get everything nice and level and squared out. Or did I just. No, I did do that right. Yep, cool. It's just me. It's just me and the angle I'm sitting on. And then you take. Like so. Like so. And then, slides in there, slides in the pig hole, bang, bang, and done. And that's it, guys. That's it. It's done. But, Billy, what's with the Kiwi holding a gun? Now, this is cool. Um, if you can tell by the picture, the lid's open. One thing that frustrates the hell out of me is opening one of these things and having it snip shut on you. So, paint your pot goes in, and mind you, it does work on the smaller ones, and I'll turn this to the side. Oh, bit of blue tack. Turn this to the side, so opens up, shove the kiwi in, and it can't close. Take the kiwi out, and this is why I said super glue. And it shuts. And then Kiwi goes in. And that's it. These things are awesome. Um, I got three. I don't know why. 
I felt like buying three. Um, I'll, I'll find use for three, because none all can go in one. Contrast, contrast, and something else. Um, it does work on the smaller pots too, because that's why it's got the three different levels there. Um, easy enough. And yeah, guys, I like it. I mean, please, I like I said, I haven't glued them together, so these will, will fall apart, but, you know, here's trouble. Guys, you're not going to find it. Like, it's even trying to do that, it's hard. And once it's super glued in, like, it's not going to fall. Anyway, that's why I got them. I don't want them to spill over. I want it to be nice and neat. Oh, I shouldn't have pushed that around so much. I actually did make an idiot out of myself there, didn't I? But that's didn't not because it's spilt, it's just because it's leaked a little bit over the side. That's got nothing to do with the product. That's just me. But in saying that, guys, you saw it. Like, you can bash that thing around and it's not going to tip over. The basing is too big for that. Um, and it's nice and flat and it's going to sit. So, guys... Check it out if you're looking for a nice little thing to keep your paint pots in and super glue down that fit really well together because they're hex, you know, bang, get another one down the back then you can have, you know, three sitting nice and neat. Um, check them out guys, I'll have a link to these in the description, so, I mean, they are different sizes, so like I said, they're perfect for either one, whether it's your wash or your contrast paint. Or if I built the third one, it would fit a normal one. And there we go. So I've rambled on long enough. You see me build one in a couple of min what? A minute? Not even. Bit of super glue. And that's it. Alright guys. Check them out. Have a look. Send them a message. Follow them on Instagram because they do more than just this. Their terrain stuff is really cool as well. So there we go, guys. Have a good one. Night.